That's why I'm doing this again. Also, I really want to play a bit more uh, God of War. This game is amazing. Okay, let's continue. Uh, it's actually, remember, can talk, walk around a little bit? I can. So how do you become a Valkyrie? First, I train till I'm the best I can be. Then I wait till grandfather notices. And then I hope he and my dad can convince mom it's okay. You know, my father and I, we encountered a whole bunch of Valkyries. Wait, what? Where? Promise to tell me everything. I promise. Mother, did you meet Loki? Oh, now he's got you involved with this? Involved with what? I'm being friendly. Isn't that diplomacy? You understand who this is, right? What his father did? Why does he want him here? Mom! Come on, you're embarrassing me. We'll talk about this later. Sorry about her. Moms, right? So, did you want to look around some more, or do you really need to get to work? Shut up and drink. Keep them in the dark. Something is different. Something is different. Me. Please do not involve me in your pathetic attempts to impress one another. I was just being friendly. Come on. You haven't had enough Heimdall in your day? Let's go. Listen, whatever grandfather is having you do, remember, this is your chance to prove yourself. That's all that some of us want. <sighs> Catch you later. Yes, I, I understand. Yes. Do you see me nodding and saying, yes, I understand? I... I... Uh-huh. Yes. Yes, all right. Mm-hmm. Ah. You see, the, this is you not letting me talk. No, Hugan, I, I don't need my ears clean. I need you to stop croaking and, and, and accept the answer you know I'm about to give. I was just looking at this. That old thing. I've had that since. Huh. Who can remember? <laughs> you, you have a name? Ingrid. Really? Sure, why not? Take it, if you like it that much. For real? Consider it a perk of the job. Thank you. I mean, really. And they say I'm the bad guy. Come on, let's walk. You're welcome. Everyone's got me all wrong. You think war drives... Power, wealth? Nah, never have. You know what drives me? What I really want. The rift? I huh, want odd name. Well, um, I. See, mortals have it easy. When they push up. I'm gonna be a little quiet throughout the stream. Late at night, so, up. you know. They give them meaning, divine comfort. <laughs> we both know that's a sham. But when we have questions, why are we here to give meaning to mortals while living without it ourselves? No more than that and I found something that proves it what is it it's what drives me you feel it don't you feels like knowledge truth all truth all the answers 
We could find out why we're here, learn how to change our fate, stop Ragnarok for good, maybe? Save the people we love? How? I was a young god when I found it. Spent lifetimes studying it, following every clue down every dead end. Looking for and finally unearthing this. You see that? It shares the same mystical energy. It opened a crack. Can we just look inside? I wouldn't recommend that. Yeesh, that does not look good. What's the broken mask for? You recognize any writing on it? These aren't from the Nine Realms. Small there. Obsidian Ispitha. From smoldered earth and obsidian spark and a field of battles never fought are you certain because if that's the clue i know what it means most for lime what's that keep working with me and find out you don't have to kill anyone you don't have to betray your father or yourself come on i know you felt what i felt the answers are in there let's get them I mean, you translated this language like it was nothing. If I do help you, what's next? Thor! Get down here! All oh, father. Don't do that! What's next is chasing this down. Take this. And this stealthy side of beef. And see where it takes you. I don't promise anything. Nonsense. Happy hunting. And you, go easy on him, you hear me? God, that will never not be creepy. Just the crows buzzing all around. Loose Bahar. The rest of the mask is here. It's where all father dropped us. What do you think? Take that and do your damn job. So, where's the realm tower? How the fuck am I supposed huh, to know? Down there? I'm guessing. All father thinks that you know what you're doing. So do it. Oh, that's cool. Mass guidance. This place is gold. Yeah. Huh. Well, it seems like we go through this rock. I was gonna get that. <laughs> With those arms. Let's see what Loki in that shiny toothpick <laughs> There. It looks like there might be a ledge we could reach. If we too slow. Hey! <laughs> you can't just grab people like that. No, but uh throw you. <laughs> Stay young. Things up there hitting us with fire. Use your ball already. You know, 
I took my blood payment from your father for what happened to my son. And I have to take it. Yes. What do you mean? Later. I don't want to keep the All-Father waiting. Speaking of which, mask. Right. We need to head through those rocks. Hey, can you... <laughs> Look at him doing a little jog. Yeah, that. Just imagine what it can do to bone. You want to talk about blood payment? What about the giants you killed? They were my family. Thalmor, Ronair, they were your people too. The giants were blight on the Nine Realms and I reveled in every single one of their deaths. Let's just change the subject. Y you know, uh... The last time Father and I were here, we beat every one of Surtur's trials. Think you could... Don't play me. Listen. Modi had some problems, but he was my son. And the only reason you aren't mush right now is because of that broken piece of wood. Look! Clearly neither of us can do this mission alone. And I want to impress the Allfather just as much as you do. You don't have to like me, but we're gonna have to trust each other. Just a little bit. Trust. Saying to go. Hey, kid, where's the mask pointers? The mask is uh pulling this way. We'll have to find some way down. Sure thing. I wasn't playing you, by the way. The trials are fun. Don't you ever have fun? You're so different from your daughter. She seems. Seen... Hey, come look at this. Thor, what the? <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Wait, Surtur shrines. You didn't huh. die over there, did you? Oh wait, I think I know where we are. Right. That means. Huh. Yeah. Realm Tower is supposedly behind us. Okay. No, but I was thinking. Well, that's your problem. <sighs> the trials are just past that cliff. Might be something we include in here. First, we deal with them. Come on, Lord. Just check them out. What have you got to lose? That's right. Just try it. You getting tired? Not in the slightest. Out the... An ogre. Don't worry. Not in the slightest. You take this one. Another ogre? Yeah, fuck! 
father's waited hundreds of winters. He can wait a little more. It's fun. Fine. Stay right here. Yes, sir. Huh. Oh, actually, yeah, no, we're in the trials. Yeah, these are the trial areas. Yeah, I remember this. That should keep him busy for a while. Hopefully. Huh. Now to get to that shrine. Yeah, it sounds like he's having fun back there. Hey, Ingrid. Do you trust the Ace here? I mean, I know I can't trust them. I just need them to trust me. But that's only gonna happen if they think I trust them. Yeah. Ah! Can't you guys go fight Thor or something? Alka! Yeah, wow, you can really hear Thor having fun. Okay, uh, grab that. And look at the thing. Again. If I remember correctly, yeah. This is where we started the trials. No! My god! It's her! You know, for someone who is a warrior, you are tragically easy to start on. I didn't. No, no, we were startled. A girl can't visit a shrine of her own volition? No. You're here for Sorter's Marvel. Ooh. Maybe. <laughs> You're out looking for more giant marbles? You know what this looks like, right? Like the life story of one of our people? And also Wait, look, Thor. Rewriting my story. Odin gave that to you? It's not. Well, he did, but it's not. I'm not working with him. I would never tell him anything about Ironwood if that's what you're worried about. And I'm definitely not serving him. Prophecy's words, not mine. I've got a marble to find. You're welcome to help if you want. Fun. But are you sure you're up for breaking the rules like this? There aren't any prophecies of you collecting any marbles. Our endings haven't been written, right? Come on. Shame. <laughs> Hello there. A sentient sword. Huh. Another marble. Surters. No soul in it, though. So he's still out there somewhere. A while back, you talked about how the giants left. You ever think about them? All the time. They're far from here. Far from Odin and Thor. But I wonder what lands they've gone to. What seas they've crossed. Why? I want to find them. I'm going to save my father, and then I'll find them. It's starting. Who is that? Not Surtur, that's for sure. Look at all that frost. Sinmara. Hmm. Don't think I've heard of her before. And here comes Surtur. Wow. This must have been some fight. Yeah, until it... wasn't? They just stopped? Oh, no, 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 look. It's because they fought together. Looks like they even became friends. Uh, good friends. Are they? Yeah, I think they are. Oh, well that's... good for them. But it looks like they're... um... 
love caused them to combine into some kind of huge creature. Ragnarok. And then... Ragnarok destroys Asgard. Right. I saw that in Groa's shrine. Well, that was... something. Oh, hey, remember the snake we put that soul in? Can't really forget that. I saw it. It's getting... bigger. Like... Than normal, big <gasps> Another Jormungandr? Hopefully. Okay, no, That'd no. be cool. Huh. I'm gonna hang back here. Don't want your, uh, friend to see a giant he missed. Of course. Just be careful. Please. You too, Loki. Hey, Ingrid. I think Thor died from... You thought you could defeat the God of Thunder? Oh. Huh. Huh. You'd need my help if you beat all those trials. Or did you just watch your father? Hey, what's taking so long? Ha! There he is, right there. Sitting, watching me, like a weirdo. You wouldn't believe the scores of these things I just killed. It was glorious. Hmm. <laughs> Well, at least he's taking a liking to us now. I think you're right. Through Woodland. She'd be faring better than you, at <clears> least. <throat> Come on. Time. You seem to be handling yourself well enough. I was trusting you. So, where to? Let me check. Looks like we need to head through that gate. Thor? Ain't that impressive. Real god stuff. You are a god. You're damn right. And so am I. It's here. This is the spot. Well, where is it? In the lava? I don't know. God damn, that's a dumbass move. hand in lava is never gonna feel good. I wasn't thinking. You're an okay kid. You're still a giant, and I'll revel in killing you too. What did you do, Loki? <laughs> the rift got brighter. Look, you did it. Look, one of these phrases is complete now. We can read it all. But you can't translate. Not yet. See, I got a little theory. I think if we can find the rest of this, we can use it to look into that without, you know. Losing an eye, or worse. Look at this. We make a good team. Don't we? Don't we? Make a good damn team? Just like you and Balder. You both behave out there? Thor was really great. 
I learned a lot from him. You learned something from him? Really, now? <laughs> okay. What did you teach the kid? Nothing. What could I possibly teach him? Exactly. Ah, I was wondering where that went. Actually, I had a pretty good idea. Change of heart. I'm not really sure why I came to Asgard. But I realize now it wasn't to be a spy. I need you to know you can trust me. And if I'm gonna help you take this to the end, I need to be able to trust you. And trust is earned. I get it. Take this, figure out the rest of it. If you're staying, that is. You're gonna tell me what you're really looking for in there. Translate that, and I'll tell you everything. And on that, young man, you can trust me. You always this hard on Thor? Seems like you're mad at him or something. Ooh, getting nosy, getting personal. No, I get it, but it's nothing like that. It's, well, to be honest, it's the only language he understands. I'm serious. Go ahead and try being nice to him. See where that gets you. Huh, dragon skull in the library. No big deal. Yeah, no big deal. It looks pretty cool. Huh. Floating rocks everywhere. What is this? Hacksilver. Taking money from Odin. Taking more money from Odin. Crack it open in front of Odin. Taking everything from Odin. Odin. Oh. Shiny. Huh. What's this do? Ah, oh, look, it's one of the things. Runic capacity. Uh, bow. Ace your bow. Runic summon. Huh. Oh, I can't ride the falcons. Nah, that'd be cool if I could. Ah, current level. Wait. Can I? No, I need something with a high amount of damage. Eh, damage will be up. Um, no, no, no. Oh, this one. Falcon dive. No. Also, looks like yeah, they have the same thing, but um, because they're cooldown. Let me just. There we go. Armor. Accessory. It's not like aftershock. And no, I'll just keep everything as the way it is. Actually, no, they're all equipped, they're all equipped. Huh. Um... Map, skills... Are true. I need to get a lot more. Hold on. Got those down. Now this. Huh. Right. R1, 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 R1. Yeah, yeah. High ground. I like the name. The salt. Arctic reversal. Hmm. Okay. Looks like I have everything for Loki. Map. Asgard. Gladysheim. Him throws wall. Great Lodge, the Rift, <coughs> Plains of Ida, look, little round tower, Vanaheim, Southern Wild, Freya's Camp, Eastern Bounds, Eastern Barry Woods, Alfheim, Niflheim, Yeah, it's funny because we've only been down to here till here. I really see what's past it. It's kind of cool though. Uh, oh, sorry. Blabbing on.
Hugin? Gonna try not to think too hard about the floating rocks. That is weird though. The floating rocks. I don't know what's making them float. Ha! father behave himself yeah I mean better than I would have expected I guess is that the sword from grandfather's study oh yeah her name's Ingrid <laughs> hi Ingrid wow all well, father must really trust you well glad you survived your first day hey me too tomorrow we talk about Valkyries definitely This has been a weird day. Exactly. Hmm. Nicely equipped. What needs work? Good morning, brother. No news, I'm afraid. I have a plan. Do you now? The Nords. You found them once. Could you do so again? I could try, but I don't see how that they would help. They are the fates of these lands, are they not? I would know what they know. You may not find them cooperative. As long as I find them, where do we search? Midgard. But if Atreus is in Asgard, there's no getting him back without an army. We should be raising one. Yes, nothing like a catastrophic war to improve the situation. The boy seems quite capable, perhaps if you simply give him some time. You are not free of blame here. You encouraged his foolishness. Confusion. I do not seek war. But if Odin has stolen my son, do not doubt the lengths I will go to. Your nature has always been clear, Kratos. But you, Freya. War is a first resort. That's not the Freya I knew. 
I hope the Norns can give you the counsel you need. Perhaps mine is no longer of use here. Tear, stop. This is no time to divide ourselves further. Come, sit, please. You have been quiet. Frankly, I'm surprised you of all people would seek out fate. But your instincts haven't let us down so far. Let's find the norms. Who am I to offer him counsel? I only hoped to help the boy find his answers. And I failed. What's my role in all this now? Tyr, you're at the center of this. You always have been. That's why Odin imprisoned you in the first place. He's terrified of you. I doubt that very much. It's the truth. And not just because of prophecies. No one has ever united the realms as you once did. That is not who I am anymore. I know you feel that way now. I've lost myself before. More than once. But believe me, there is something beyond that. And what is that? Purpose. Purpose is the path that leads you to yourself. So you would have me accept my fate. Lead your armies into war. Secure your vengeance. If securing our justice is not your purpose, then find another for your own sake. Does it hurt? Oh, this? Only when I worry. How would Atreus get to Asgard? I'm sorry, but you'd have to ask Odin. He's got control of every path. I know how highly you esteem our expertise on such things, so I'm sure that's disappointing. He's just been one step ahead of us. But I hope Sinji makes a full recovery. That head injury looks bad. Sinji! Yes. Before you go traipsing off into the dawn, I thought you'd like to have this back. Oh, our shield. Well, don't go getting too cheery about it. <laughs> but you're well. I've collected what we need to find the Norns. Shall we go? Yeah, let's go. Guardian shield. Laufe. I suspect huh. we may have consequences to look forward to. Yeah. The one we killed? Yeah. That was like... <laughs> oh my god, they're alive! 
Ah, oh, they're adorable. Look at them. Look at them go. Okay, uh, we can talk to him right here. Squirrel. Ah, Squirrel. Mr. Kratos, my apologies. Madame Nepo's disappearance weighs heavily on my mind. She, uh, um. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. We killed her. We're sorry. She was here even before I arrived, and that was ages ago. To even think something could keep her away from her babies. Terrible. Just terrible. <laughs> Certain the trace could not still be in Midgard. I was just there and found no trace. If Odin invited him, he must have provided a way. No, that is not the only explanation. Tell me where we find these Norns. I discovered some of their threads near the frozen lake. I stashed one for spellcrafting, but we may also use it to find them. Just remember, they really don't want to be found. Well, at least things will be difficult for a change. We should take your sled and head to the lake. Oh, this means we get to see the dogs again. Missed the freezing gusts and constant radar attacks. Ha! Huh. Because they believe Kratos is responsible for Fimble Winter and that killing him will end it. Where would they get an idea like that? Hmm. For me, of course. No. Of course. The dogs. Good girls. Come on, be nice. No. Better they get this from you. Huh. What is it? Once Come on. the wolves have the scent of the norns, we'll just need to follow their lead. Hmm. Nom nom. I will open the gate. Oh, there's the gate. Oh, that's right. The gate over here. Stop whining. Their fur is matted. When did you last brush them? Huh. That's true. Take care of you. Brother, what exactly do you intend to ask the norms? How I may find my son. Nothing more. I don't imagine it's a chance to clear up all this mess about prophecy. Perhaps get a second opinion on your alleged demise. You didn't tell me you had a death prophecy? When Atreus and I reached Jotunheim, we found a hidden mural. The giants. Fay herself had foreseen our entire journey long ago. Who we would meet, who we would fight, all of it, as it happened. But you aren't dead. That image was from a time yet to come. I see. You've never struck me as someone who fears death. That's not the problem, is it? No. Death can have me when it earns me. Then maybe it's not the future that bothers you. Faye sent you on your journey, and she made sure you'd see that image at the end of it. And you're still not sure why. I wish to speak of this no further. Now that we are on the lake, how will we find the Norns? Watch the wolves closely. See how their heads point the way?
Well, the Lake of Nine has certainly seen better days. Raiders have made themselves quite at home. Not sure I've been back to these parts since our great battle with Seekrin. She speaks highly of that fight as well. You know of that. She told me all about it when she found me. She believed you could be an ally. Long before I believed it. The Valkyrie Queen. An ally. I'm the Valkyrie Queen. As Sigrun was stubbornly determined to remind me. I should have guessed it was Sigrun helping you recover yourself. He's so loyal. Why? Clever. Oh. Mm-hmm. Doesn't take a love goddess to see where you're coming from. This thread of fate we are tracing. It's not somebody's life, if that's what you mean. The Norns use it to mark their way when they're outside of the well. The wolves lead us here. I just hope the Norns are somewhere indoors. I'm warm. Safe to say, no, I have not missed Midgard and Fimblewinter. Thank you. <laughs> We will see soon enough. Incoming fire! Something in here is giving it power. Might I suggest the ominous broken gravestone? The hilt of a sword. Brother, I know that sword hilt. <laughs> Tread carefully. You of all people know how weapons can carry ghosts. If it does not help us oh, ha! Yeah, Ghost of Sparta, Blades of Chaos. Ha, <laughs> funny. Let's keep looking. This way. I feel a trace of their illusions here. I can try to dispel it. Open up. There's nothing here. A false trail. I'm afraid so. We'll have to see what else the wolves can find. Typical Nornish mischief. They know we're searching. I warned you they wouldn't make it easy. And what's the hilt of a cursed king have to do with any of it? Distraction? Coincidence? Who knows? I suppose they'd say we were fated to find it. Mm. The Nords live in a well. 
No. The well of Earth, their mm. home is hard to explain. <coughs> it's in no fixed place. Entrances come and go. <coughs> A place wholly under their influence, where the intangible becomes tangible. Like being inside your own mind. But if we go in together, are we in each other's minds? Not so sure I like the sound of that. Mimir, have you encountered these norns? Not personally. Bray is right, they have ways of discouraging visitation. Odin made his share of efforts, wouldn't talk about what he found. Either he gave up, or he wanted to forget what he saw. There, you mind telling us what you experienced when you sought the Norns last time? To be honest, the details are hazy. Like waking up from a dream. Mainly, I remember that nothing could be done to change my son's fate. Which only made me more determined to try. Let's see. I feel something. In this direction. Feel what exactly? Another illusion. It's coming from this wall. The Norns are hiding something. Oh, no. Nothing. Another dead end. Enemy behind you, Kratos! That's frost in my neck, stop! only get more dangerous then we keep looking back to the wolves then <laughs> the wolves have picked up another trail keep following their heads Brother, what of your story? You faced the fates of your homeland, yeah? The legends I heard about the ghost of Sparta were surely exaggerated. Exaggerated? Oh, not in the brazen bloodshed righteous fury part. The part where it said you traveled back in time itself to win a battle once lost. It strains credulity, obviously. I mean, a rumor about Thor knocking the world serpent back in history from Ragnarok is one thing. It is the truth. The threads of fate span all life and time. The sisters of fate abused their power. When I challenged them, they threatened to undo my existence. So I killed them and turned their power on Zeus. That's the most dangerous and irresponsible thing I've ever heard. These Norns have no such magic. Nor does anyone in these realms that I've ever seen. Brother, seems the wolves have led us here. 
We need to work our way up. This way. Can you cut a way through the ice? Oh, are the norms making magical ice walls now? No. I think the water just froze. <laughs> 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 did to trick all these raiders into guarding them. Not that they have any idea that's what they're doing. Freya, thank you for your help. I know this was not your focus. The sooner we find your son, the sooner you'll be able to focus. I just hope it works. Just the same. Thank you. A fine sentiment, but right on a bloody note when we're out of the cold, brother. Bloody dear. Found it. Ah, isn't it always the third place you look? <laughs> is everyone hearing that creepy whisper? It is like an itch in the mind. It means we've stepped into their domain. Be ready for anything. Illusions. Projections, possibly. But assume nothing. There's no telling what manner of creature they've made unwitting guards. Delightful. Weapon of the gods, tower against his creators. 
Ghost of Sparta, Fame of Olympus, Destroyer of Fate, Cool Strider, Bringer of War, Weapon of the Gods, Turned against his creators. He chases a redemption he knows he can never deserve. He Let's fucking go! My god, he was so damn annoying. Okay, okay, we're good. He certainly seemed real enough. I hate to tell you, the parts in your mind will be real too. Go! 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 
This place almost looks familiar, but different, like a confused memory. A rather hostile memory at that. These fates should know I will not be deterred. Freya of the Valley, Master of Magic. Of the Falcon, Witch of the Wounds, Friend of Asgard, Destroyer of all she would hope to protect. She always finds somebody to blame. She cannot. Damn it. Cannot change? See? You forgot, smartest man alive! There's one small consolation to this ordeal. At least we won't have to introduce ourselves. Don't credit your reputation, Mamiya. <laughs> they see the whole lives of any who approach them. What is that? A phantom! Rogue magic! Aim for the runic core! What the hell? Look at that thing! Whoa. That's it! 
Another gift of Fimblewinter, I suppose. The magic draining out of all of us has to end up somewhere. This way. The Norns are somewhere in that cave just ahead. That itchy sound again. Normally, I don't mind ladies whispering in my ear, but this is positively awesome. Anyone ever tell you that you babble when you're terrified? <laughs> terrified? I'll have you know I'm at the very most deeply apprehensive. 
And breaking tension with humor is the sacred duty of a traveling companion. I, how very dare you! Babbling! Official. My boy. That is the it's a great transition, but still. You are not welcome here. Wait! Spalder, come back! Talk to me! Kill issue. Brother, over here. Come get me. I want none of this. Nemi! Secret? Brother, hold off. Why did you never turn on Odin? But I did. I tried to stop him any way I could. Don't lie to me! You served Odin from the day you met to the day he put you in that tree. You sought to me. You wanted his war! You watched him mistreat everyone and everything! And you never gave my death until you turned on! I know, Seagrin. It's true. All of it. But for love of you, I became a better man. A counselor for me. An ally to all those who... Were you an ally to Freya in her suffering? To Scotty? To Groa? Or to Tanya? No! You! Took the side of the power you Brother, watch out! There's more of them! Even now, you see a violent god in need, and you can't help but aid him and call him bro. <clears throat> there were a lot of enemies. A lot of enemies. Did what you must. Brother, the tree is pulling me in. Mamiya! Brother, help me! He's a monster! 
Atreus, I am coming! Yeah. Why didn't you trust your own son? Don't let him take me! Atreus! Atreus, I am coming! Why didn't you try your own son? Don't let him take me! Atreus! Why wouldn't you see him the way he wants to be seen? Pass the test. Didn't feel much like succeeding. I see the door has disappeared. Or they it toy with us still. What is that? A Kelpie. Don't see many of those in these parts. She must be theirs. Will she take us to them? I'll ask her. Nicely. Easy, girl. Easy. That's right. Good. You have to talk about whatever the norms put you through? No. Get on. That's a good lass. Lovely creatures, but temperamental by reputation. In my land, they'd keep children away from the lost by telling them a Kelpie would drown them. Of course, no Kelpie I know would do such a thing. Unless it was disrespected. It walks on water. Aye. No mystical water steeds to speak of in Greece, brother? Hmm. There were the Hippocamps. They served the Sea God. I battled one upon a Titan. <laughs> that might not be her favorite subject. <laughs>
Kratos, Freya, and Mimir's head. Enter the home of the Norns, tentatively. They have finally reached their destination. Kratos speaks first. I, I seek, seek my, my son. son. <laughs> you know the child is an Asgard. No, you seek what all who search for us seek. To know the ending to your story. The ghost of Sparta furrows his brow menacingly. He resists the urge to grunt. No, oh, he fails. You come to us, piteous archetypes, seeking freedom from your scripts. As if knowing your lines would grant you the power to rewrite them. Speak plain. <laughs> you will die, Kratos of Sparta. But you called him the destroyer, the destroyer of fate. fate. There, there must, must be a way, way to subvert, subvert destiny. destiny. There is no destiny, Puck. The protagonists are speechless. They do not understand. There is no grand design, no script. Only the choices you make. That your choices are so predictable, merely make us seem prescient. When my son was born, born shut up! up. <laughs> Your prophecy said he would die a needless death, and he did. Because you could not let him go. Because he thirsted for revenge. And because you kill gods. But what Kratos did, it was not out of hate. Should I bring him a crown then? He still slays gods, but now he's sad about it? You are the sum of your choices, nothing more. And because your choices never change, you will learn that Heimdall intends to kill your son in Asgard, and you will do what you do best. And then Ragnarok. The skies burn, the curtains fall. Exunt omni. Heimdall. <laughs> Again, he misses the point. Focusing on the second act to the exclusion of the final. A common mistake in storycraft. We are Everything. leaving. He stomps away, followed closely by Freya. I enjoyed your story, Kratos. Pity it has to end so soon. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that was... educational. <laughs> Let us leave this place. Happily. Things getting more normal already. Wait. That tree. Well, isn't that interesting? What is this? That's the noose, brother. The one Odin hanged himself with. As part of his endless mad quest for secrets of life and death and what have you. What are you doing? It's a charged object, significant to Odin. Perhaps I'll find a use for it. Brother, what they said about the boy... ...will not happen. Oh, I agree. It will not happen. We will not let it. Of course we bloody won't. The question is how? You wouldn't seriously consider killing Heimdall, would you? I will do what I must. Oh, is that all? 
You're wrong to dissuade him, Amir. You know Heimdall. I grant you that he's a spiteful, vicious little shit. And so loyal, Odin entrusted him with Galahorn. If we have the chance to eliminate him before Ragnarok, we shouldn't hesitate. Considering his powers of foresight alone, that is an if of mountainous size. Even supposing we're all perfectly comfortable plotting an assassination, and I, for one, am a mite rusty at that measure, we've got no way to reach Heimdall, and no way to kill him if we did. I have killed gods greater than him. I don't doubt that, brother, but it's hardly my point. Kratos, I see something. Look, I think we're missing the Norn's message here. We've all got our tendencies, and yours is to run headlong into danger to protect the ones you love. I do not intend to change. Not about that. Why should you? Apparently my tendency is to kill the ones I love. Freya... I don't need you to comfort me. Either of you. Their accusation was cruel. None of us believe... The truth can be a cruel thing. Anyone care to argue with that? No. But Baldur's fate had many causes. Prophecy among them. How do you mean, brother? There are many tales in my homeland of those who fulfilled prophecy by attempting to avoid it. So it was when Freya tried to protect Baldur. And so it was when I accused my son of going to Asgard. Can we agree? It'd be foolish to go after Heimdall. No. If Heimdall must die for Atreus to live, then Heimdall must die. How can you say that, knowing what you know? Because if Heimdall is a threat to my son, I must act. It is Your my... nature. Well played, Norns. <clears throat> Circle back. Let us find a gateway. Return home. Consider our plans. Listen, brother. Before you make any hasty decisions, why don't you blow off a little steam? I'm sure there was some loose end we meant to circle back to. Give your mind a little time to process everything. I suspect there's unfinished business here at the lake, though... I'm certainly happy to spend time somewhere other than Midgard. It's your choice, brother. Oh. Look, there's some debris over there. I'm guessing... Defend from... the peace. I remember the Jotnar crafting these bracers for Tyr's statue. They chose only their most talented and accomplished to do the job. You have a good memory, Freya. Like Tyr, the Jotnar also believe the best offensive strategy is a good defense. So... This is how they chose to honor them. The giants were not wrong. Can't believe we missed this. Tell me of this power Heimdall wields. He sees the future. More like he reads the person, sees their intention. My intent will be to kill him. Knowing that will be no Brother, advantage. Brother, this is no one to underestimate. Any move you make, he'll have seen it coming. If you must face him, we need something else. An edge. Humor me? Very well. We will ask the dwarves. Ah. The inevitable asking of the dwarves.
Excuse me, sir. Could I have a moment of your time? Oh dear, what oh dear, it what's to be done? It has come to my attention that Neethog has been slain. And as a result, her offspring have been let loose into the Nine Realms. What of it? Unfortunately, without a proper role model to supervise them, the little rascals are certain to fall to mischief. In time, said mischief could culminate in nothing less than their devouring of the Nine Realms entirely. In order to avoid such a grisly fate, I'd like you to bring the lean worms to me. I believe I can act as a satisfactory paternal figure in their upbringing. You'll find the specimens gnawing on tears throughout the realms. Use this device to safely store them, bring them back to me, and I promise I'll make it worth your while. You mean to say you'd raise them by yourself? Indeed. I have no small experience managing extreme personalities. Compared to wrestling with my emotions in the most literal of senses, I dare say raising a handful of leaned worms will be a walk in the park. Anyhow, was there something else you wished to talk about? About Neethog. You should know. We had no choice. It was Odin's doing. Oh, I am very well aware indeed of the alleged All-Father's role in this tragedy. Sadly, there's no expecting him to clean up after himself. Not all gods showed the interest that you do in writing past wrongs. I do hope you're able to locate those lean worms. Good luck to you. I think that's the long and short of it. Safe travels. They're back. They're back! Simmer down, I see them. Whatever you need. I have news. Oh, did the Norns tell you how to get Atreus back? Do we have a plan? The Norns say Atreus will be killed by Heimdall. The plan is to kill Heimdall first. Oh, wow. Okay, Heimdall. Let's see. Never loses. Sees everything coming. Unpopular at parties. This won't be easy. Whatever his advantages, I will overwhelm him with my own. That's the idea. You gotta overpopulate his senses, see? And I got just the thing in mind to help you do it. Sindri, go get Dropnir. Dropnir? But we need him, our supplies. Oh, we got plenty, and to spare. Even if we did, Dropnir's no weapon. Why would a, oh, you mean we combine it with? That's right. And then when he, it'll go. Damn you, that's brilliant. Very well. I suppose there's nothing to do but go fetch Dropnir. Dropnir? I bloody knew these two had nicked it. And Odin blamed me for it disappearing. They stole Dropnir. We didn't steal nothing. We just ungifted what never should have been gifted in the first place. How will this help me kill Heimdall? Never you mind all that. It's a fucking surprise. We're artists. But to even store Dropnir, you'd need... You were saying... So now you intend to kill Heimdall. Violence cannot prevent violence, Kratos. I truly thought you understood that. No matter what you thought I understood, my son is in danger.
you, little one. Got it! I think. Son, we... Enough! Heimdall's a threat, not only to Atreus, but to everyone. He's Odin's left hand, and he carries the horn that begins Ragnarok. If we have the chance to eliminate him, we then should... it's just as likely a trap, because the bastard knows your intentions. Kratos, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on him. Not one. Well, I gathered what's fit for gathering. How long will it take? We'll have to go to Svartalfheim to get the rest of the materials. Not to mention, we'll have to visit the lady. Oh. Whew. Whew. That's a relief. <laughs> Ow. Kratos, whenever you're ready. No idea what he's on about, brother. See you out there. <gasps> ah, time to go see the lady. I'll take it from here. Oh, no. This whole thing were my idea. I'll speak to the lady. I never get to speak to the lady. There are reasons for that. Brock will go. What? No, no, no. I you have to. heard him. Quit your friend. I ain't gonna mess nothing up. What the? <sighs> no, you pimple shrimps. Think that'll keep us out? Well, think the fuck again. What was all that then? Oh, just Sindri trying to hog all the glory. Same old shit. Not that. The gate. What's wrong with a bloody gate? Most likely someone in neither of the been making a fuckery of the works. Probably on account of all that incursion in you got up to. But don't worry, you little dangling head. Old Brock came prepared. I got ways in and out from the old days. Gates said never even think to look for, on account of being stupid. Brock, where are we? This here's your stop. Abandoned service time. Direct to the forge camp. I'll meet you up there. Go on. Brock. And he's gone. You sure he was the right pick for this, brother? I trust him. He speaks plain. And yet so tough. Cooperating, maybe someday it'll be Asgard in flames. That is not my goal. Doesn't mean it's not your destiny. What are you insinuating, Highness? Not a thing. Hmm. Poor bugger. Why would he hide in here? He feared something in these tunnels more than he feared starving. Hardly seems rational. Fear seldom is. Explosives. Little on the nose for dwarven culture, isn't it? Ridiculing a culture you helped undermine. Classic Aesir. Oh, all right. Might be oh. that one. Oh. Careful, brother. 
That was flammable. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I can see why it's an abandoned service tunnel. Fortuitous oil spill. You know what, um, it's getting late at night, um, for me, uh, so I will leave the stream off over here. If you like what you saw, please consider a follow, and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.